Hello, I'm Andrew Winterstein. I'm a distinguished clinical professor at the University of Wisconsin in Madison, Wisconsin. I also serve as an adjunct faculty member for the Doctor of Athletic Training program in the Arizona School of Health Sciences here at A.T. Steele University. Well, I think the Doctor of Athletic Training program is really focused on creating that thing we call a scholarly professional, someone who has taken the time to go above and beyond and, and get additional training and knowledge in very specialized areas to help become the professional leader of tomorrow or to help become that more advanced clinician that can move the dial for athletic training deeper into the healthcare realm. I think one of the advantages to the DAT program at ATSU is the format and the way the curriculum is structured. The opportunity to maintain your current athletic training position and to work asynchronously in the blocks of courses from your home in an online format uh, really provides some opportunity for the working athletic training professional who wants to go back and do this kind of work. Somebody who is attracted to the DAT is probably a, a clinician, maybe someone who has worked already in the field for a period of time, who wants to go back and experience a level of advanced scholarship to become a professional scholar so that they can have an influence in many aspects of athletic training. What ATSU really does well is it has populated its program with some of the very best and brightest minds in athletic training. So what's important and what attracted me to be a part of this group is genuinely the people. I also think you have to take a look at the format that they're willing to offer this education to create a, a tremendous amount of access and accessibility to all kinds of students from all walks of life through the online opportunities combined with these wonderful intensive in-person experiences like the Winter Institute. I've been very fortunate to come to all of the Winter Institutes that have been held and I've yet to walk away without hearing something that has challenged me to go back and look at something I'm already doing either in my uh, professional scope or my teaching practice and I've always come away with some thought-provoking idea that really moves the needle and say wow no one else is talking about this and I just heard this here. The ability to take information and build those bridges is so important and I think that's a lot of what we're trying to accomplish to help people get those skills to reach that type of practitioner. Because at the end of the day, all of us are trying to make contributions that improve patient care. The students come from all over the country, but the unifying force that brings them together is their participation in this DAT program. The benefit is you are forever tied to this group of like-minded professionals that you can share ideas, possibly collaborate with, and I think it creates a format for natural collaboration, whether it's in projects, research, professional committees. I think that that community can extend in many, many different ways. I would absolutely recommend the ATSU Doctor of Athletic Training Program, and I have recommended it to colleagues and people who ask me for advice on this type of degree, simply because I think it is one of a kind right now in its offering, its structure, and it is, quite frankly, unmatched in the quality of the faculty that the students will interact with. I have never been more excited about the possibility of where athletic training can go because of the inroads we're making into healthcare settings. And I think a lot of those inroads are being made by the very thought-provoking work that's being done at ATSU.